we're going to be doing some practice problems from the physics and chemistry section of the MCAT. Problem one, a physical therapist asks a patient to hold a five kilogram dumbbell steady in their hand with the forearm held horizontally. The bicep muscle is attached four centimeters from the elbow. This is the pivot and the dumbbell is 32 centimeters from the elbow. What is the magnitude of the force the bicep must exert to maintain this position? And assume gravity is 10 meters per second squared. All right, okay, so for this first problem, all right, so this is a very classical problem in torque. And the main thing to keep in mind with torque is that it is the product of the force times the distance from the pivot. As long as we set these two equal to each other, we'll have one unknown, we solve for that one unknown, and we get our answer. In this case, the two opposing forces are the muscle and the weight. They've told us the amount of force and the distance. The only other thing we have to figure out is that the five kilograms is technically not a force. That is a mass. So we have to multiply by 10. So the actual force of the dumbbell is not five kilograms. It is 50 newtons. When we set these two equal to each other, we can solve for the only thing we need, which is the force due to the bicep muscle. And we should get 400 newtons. Take a look at the calculation. If you have a question, drop it in the comments and let me know.